Have you ever found a pen that works so well for you, you feel that it's the perfect pen? You feel that there's no need to use any other type of pen, because all you want to do is draw with just that one pen. Fountain pens are the type of pen that is like that for me. They write very smoothly, I can draw very expressively, I can draw fast, there's all kinds of different inks for them, different colors, different sizes of bottle of ink. You've got such a large variety of different inks that you can use for these pens. And you've even got pens that are vintage style, that are collectible. You've got pens that are very expensive in the thousands of dollar ranges. And then you've got pens that are much cheaper. The pen that I'm drawing with here is a Red Lamy Safari. I got it online for only $30. And I got some ink with it as well. A really large bottle. And the big bottle of ink was only $10. And it's the Newler's um, Heart of Darkness. It's a really dark ink. And it's kind of a dry ink, it feels like to me. And the pen writes dry. And I like that because I'm not putting too much ink onto the paper. Because the way I draw is more detailed. And I also like to draw expressive. But I want to be in control of what I'm drawing. Now that I've been using this pen, I constantly find myself thinking about drawing lines of different shapes and sizes and wavy lines and circles and triangles. I think about all the stippling I can do and all the artwork I can create. I draw so much faster with this pen. A drawing that would take me six to eight hours, I can now draw in only an hour. I enjoy fountain pen so much. I'm going to dedicate an entire sketchbook to only fountain pen drawings. You know how it feels when you have butter that's hard and won't spread on bread? And then you get a type of butter that just works perfectly and it just goes smoothly and you don't have to worry about fighting with it. That's how the pen is. It's like that big transition from using something else to what you're using now that just goes on so smoothly and perfectly. I've been looking into getting another fountain pen, or maybe two. The two that I'm looking into is the Cuico Sport and the Noodler's Ahab. The Noodler's Ahab writes a lot wetter, and it has a flex nib as well. I just can't stop thinking about the crisp, perfect, smooth, buttery lines that this fountain pen makes. I think I'm going to go do some drawing because I keep thinking about drawing lines. I really need to create something. You have a good day.